what it do back in a bit with another food review y'all i'm like at the train station right now and i've been checking online i seen this dope ass like famous you know cheese stick restaurant where they serve like cheese sticks they serve hot dogs ice cream all that shit i ain't even gonna lie to y'all boys i'm in a mad cheese steak mood right now like i'm craving for a cheese steak it's been a minute since i had that shit i'm finna head out to that bit right now we on and finna go downtown with it man let's go i got a new plate here I'm cracking the city. I'm getting hotter on here, you know, yeah. She got a body, she freaky, yeah, yeah. I got some bodies. Yes, sir. Y'all see how I'm pulled up. So this place is called like Woody's famous like cheesesteak place or whatever like that. Like I said, I'm gonna get a cheesesteak, fuck around, get a hot dog, some milkshakes or some shit like that. We just gonna see. Y'all, I cannot fuck with these people. I just need flesh on these people. Yes, sir, y'all. We done got the grub from the famous spot, you feel me? Hey, listen, bro. As soon as I walked in that bitch, it was like all high schoolers, bro. I'm like, bro, why is everybody in here at JIT? And then I just realized, like, it's a high school, like, literally right across the street, like, down the down the street from the place that we was at. But I messed around. I got a cheesesteak. That bitch ran me $10, bro. This whole cheesesteak cost me $10.25, bro. Got some mushrooms with some bell peppers. I messed around, got a... a a hot dog they call it a fat dog oreo milkshake all that shit ran me like 22 dollars y'all so we gonna see man let me show y'all what it's looking like though okay yeah y'all seeing it this is the hot dog right here it comes with onions got some ketchup and some mustard on it too and then this right here is what i'm assuming the cheese steak oh yeah y'all seeing that damn this bitch is hot it's packed with meat all up in there got some onions like i said i asked for some uh some mushrooms too i'm not really seeing all that much cheese though it's cheese in there but it's not like crazy if that makes sense you feel me but we're gonna see though not looking too bad i'm used to the cheese like being on top instead of you know just like on the side of the bread like that so we're gonna see we're gonna get into this cheesesteak first y'all what they most famous for <coughs> Hey, yo, first bite alone, packed with flavor, bro. Like I said, they got the meat packed all up in here. I'm not really the biggest fan of mushrooms, but for this, they go crazy, bro. The cheese, like I said, it looks like it's hidden. It's a little, it looks like there's not that much cheese in there, but it's cheese like all at the bottom. <coughs> <coughs> it's cheese all at the bottom of the cheesesteak. That bro going stupid. Hold on. I'm not gonna lie for the size of it too. Like I said, it's basically like an eleven dollar cheesesteak, but it's pretty. <coughs> oh fuck! It's pretty much like a whole twelve inch. If that makes sense. So the price is worth it for real. This steak is like kind of cheap, but that's the that's the thing I like. I like the cheap steak. The more expensive steak, it doesn't really taste all that good to me. I like the steakums, like the one that you kind of put it up into a can, and it's like super chopped up and like super fine. That's the one that's in here right now. Shit, blessing, bro. Oh. They did their thing with this. Honestly, I should've ordered two of these hoes, bro, no cap. I got an Oreo milkshake too right here. We're gonna see what this hitting on. It's nothing to go crazy over. I mean, it's just a basic ass, like, you know, Oreo milkshake. I would say, I think I pay, yeah, I pay like $5 for this, no cap. This is really on the same level as like a Chick-fil-A Oreo milkshake, you feel me? Yeah, nothing to die over. It's good, nice and Oreo flavored. I mean, I don't, I don't know what else you expect from an Oreo milkshake. You feel me? I would rather go to Chick Fil A and get one. I think you can get like a whole large Oreo milkshake from Chick Fil A for maybe like three or four dollars. The price that you pay for it is honestly not worth it, bro. I can't stop eating this cheesesteak, bro. This is one of those good ones I haven't had in a long ass time, bro. And I'm super satisfied right now. Like I said, I'm loving the size. Super nice stuff in season, bro. This shit is amazing. This changed lives. I see why they famous for this now, bro. Not even gonna lie. I'm gonna have to spin the block back and get another one, bro. <laughs> this is so good. This is ridiculous. Now we finna get into this hot dog. This hot dog is big as hell. Like compared, you know, to like a normal size. I mean, but the bread is like way different. This is definitely not a hot dog bun. I don't know what type of bread this is probably like italian or like white or some shit like that you feel me it's like a big ass sausage but just split down in half i'm not the biggest fan of mustard but i was like i want all the toppings on it so we're gonna see 
I mean, it's just, just a typical hot dog, honestly. It's nothing really crazy. Like I said, the price I paid for it was like maybe like $6 or something like that. I honestly don't think it's worth the price. Nothing that screams like, oh my God, this is like the greatest hot dog ever. The price is just not worth it, bro, honestly. Like, I could have get a better hot dog from a cookout, family cookout. You can grill a better hot dog than this, no cap. <coughs> But my overall like view perspective on this cheesesteak, this is seriously one of the best cheesesteaks I had in a long ass time. Usually most of the time I'll go to American Deli and I'll get a cheesesteak from them. It's been a minute since I've been there, so I'm gonna have to swing there and get another cheesesteak from them. But this bitch right now, boy, stupid. Overall, I'm gonna give this hole a straight 9.5, bro. Straight 9.5. Flavoring is all there. Perfect seasoning. Super nice and cheesy. Like I said a million times, that cheese, it looks hidden. It looks like there's barely any cheese in here, but nah, bro. That motherfucker hit the spot. Like I said, probably the only two things I'm disappointed with this place is the price of this milkshake being $5. That shit is highway robbery, no cap, bro. I don't know what they was thinking they are or whatever. I don't care how famous y'all niggas are. Ain't no way, ain't no way y'all should be charging $4 for this little ass milkshake like this, man. It's been sitting out in the sun for a little minute, so it's like now melted and shit like that. Like I said, it busts, but the price you pay, fuck no. I'm gonna give it a straight. <coughs> <coughs> I'ma give it a straight 6.5. You know what I'm saying? Do a little justice. Nothing crazy to die over. And then back to the hot dog, bro. I just honestly, I, I seriously regret buying this shit, bro. It just is not worth it at all. Like, do not spend your money on this hot dog, bro. Like I said, you could just make some shit like this at home. Way easier, way better than this. Maybe season up some more, grill it to your liking, bro. But paying almost like $6, $5 for this shit, bro. It's just mid, honestly. I love the size, but the flavor and the taste just not there gang you feel me so overall i'm gonna give this like a straight i'm gonna give it a five bro just an average ass hot dog big as hell nothing to lose your mind over though that's just straight facts <coughs> would i come back to this place only for the cheesesteak maybe the milkshake but not the price of the milkshake if you get what i'm trying to say Honestly, this is some of the best cheesesteaks I had. If you in Atlanta and you haven't visited this place yet, like definitely do that shit, bruh. Cause they was not lying when they said famous, bruh. That shit busting. I don't know if this place was like made in Atlanta. I mean, it says famous Philadelphia. So I'm assuming the niggas that made this shit came from Philly and then they brought it here type shit. But I ain't even, I ain't even mad at that. Cause Philly, they already make the best cheesesteaks anyway. So other than that, this place hit. I'm a star forever, boy. Notice not the enemy. I'm a star forever, boy. Notice not the enemy, boy.